Grand Rising for the Chariot Tarot, where we keep moving forward through all life's obstacles. I hope you all had a good night's sleep. We are blessed to see another day, to have another chance. So, you know, let's be thankful. So, I am still in pain. So, I'm not going to be enthusiastic until my mouth stops hurting because I got my tooth pulled Saturday. My wisdom tooth is it. So, I don't know if I'm going to be like this, but. Hope you got your blood, your tea, your coffee, your water, whatever you need this morning. Okay, I'm missing my power. Give me one second. Let's read this how I can read these cards accurately and precisely with truth and clarity. Any negative energy sent towards me or anyone in the sound of my voice, send it back 10 times strong. This could be past, present, or future, so take that into consideration. Take what resonates and leave it with. I want you all to know that you are loved. I love you. Cause I know I, I never say it on here, but you know what? To the people who come to my channel to sincerely watch my messages and to try to get some kind of guidance from it, I thank you for that. And I thank you for the people who are coming just to watch, just to be petty and negative. Thank you too. Cause we all need haters, all right? But this is the no judge zone. The reason I say that is because no one can judge anyone else, okay? Because we all have things we have done that we don't want nobody to know. Okay? But most of us are trying to grow and transform our lives like the Grim Reaper. Deading, <clears throat> deadening our old ways and changing for the better. Okay. So we're going to start out with the Love Worker card. See what's going on. Holy Spirit, what's the message from you to me through the cards? What do my worldies and world ex need to know? Not what they want to know. What do they need to hear? Not what they want to hear. So what's the energy surrounding their love life? That could be passion. Someone could be looking in the mirror, reminiscing, okay? Y'all could have took pictures in the mirror. Someone is taking a chance with the hands of cards. They're playing the cards they are dealt or they're shuffling a new hand, okay? Probably because they're dealing with a snake. Someone who's been, you know, feeding them poison. Mm. So, what's the message to the little oracle deck from you to me through the cards? Oh, we got separation. <clears throat> So someone is missing you since y'all separated. Y'all are not talking. They miss you. All they do is think, all I do is think of you. Day and night, that's all I do. Okay. They have one of them kind of moments. We got, oh, excuse me. Abundance. Okay. Maybe because they see you abundant. They see, you know. You're manifesting exactly what you want, baby. And they're not. Uh-oh. Also, someone could be someone could be getting married. Someone could be thinking of proposing to someone. Or there could be a, a marriage already going on. Okay. Take it how it resonates. Also, 
take what resonates, leave the rest. Use your own spirit of discernment. If you are confused about a reading or a message that you have received, take it to God. If you are confused, also tarot is gender fluid. Male can embody the female energy on the cards, and also male I mean female can embody. Huh. Male can embody female. Female can embody male. Just say it like that, okay? Thank you. Okay, we have palm tree. So someone, since they've been separated from someone, they become abundant. They're about to get married. They're becoming stable ever since they separated from a toxic partner or a karmic partner. Someone they had karmic ties with that they have now broken, okay? Ooh, ooh, ooh. At the bottom of the deck, we got girl talk. So the girls could be talking about this. The girls could be planning a girl's trip since someone is getting married. Bachelor red party. Okay, we got keys on the ring. Somebody got many options. Someone with a one night stand, a strength alone. We got lightning, sudden, sudden change, shocking news, surprise, epiphany, upheaval, transformation. I'm telling you, since someone left, they've transformed. They did it, those situations that didn't serve them, and they've leveled up. Okay? They are no longer being treated like a one night stand. They have found their true happiness in here. Okay? So what else about this keys of ring and lightning? Because this doesn't change it. I'm telling you, it could be this marriage. Someone can now realize that they let the one go. Chasing after, you know. They let their 80 go for their 20. Okay? They let the 80 go for a 20. They let a, a quarter go for a penny. Okay? <laughs> So someone downgraded, thinking they will upgrade. Okay, okay. Like, ooh, and y'all are still came out. I said someone is, de is dealing with the cards. They are being dealt. Someone is reshuffling their hand. I'm telling you, because they fucked up. I hate to say it like that. Yes, we curse sometimes. We might not curse all the time. But yeah, we're going to curse sometimes, okay? Yeah, because, y'all, I'm telling you, a snake came up earlier, and look what them popped out now. Girl with the snake, okay? Now, I said, ooh, mm, thank you for the confirmation. Thank you, spirit. They were dealing with a, a snake. Snake popped out earlier, and it was snake by itself. It didn't have girl with the snake. It was just snake. Now we have girl with the snake, which confirms that when I split the deck, yes, there was a man who chose a twin who was a snake. And now she did charm and use his ass. And now he's trying to reshuffle the cards that he did there because he had all these choices. He thought he chose right. But now a sudden change is happening. Yeah. Now he missing his friendship. Now he missing the person he used to be with. He missed meeting and conversing with this person, having those moments, feeling uplifted because of the energy that you carry, okay? He regrets. He's in deep regret now. Hmm. I think I want to leave. I think I want to clarify these with Tarot. Yeah, I'm doing like that. Yeah, I think that'll be better. We got at the bottom of the deck. Mm. Four of Pentacles. Somebody's like facing loss. I'm telling you, they're trying to reshuffle the, the hand they be a dealt. They could have married this person, unbeknownst to you. Okay. They are committed to this person. They're in a committed relationship, even if they aren't married. Also, this person could be marrying this person. So, this is two stories. We have a man who is married, a snake, and we also have a female who has left a karmic man or female, take it how it resonates. 
You left your karmic partner and now you get a marriage. You found love. Give me something. Clarify the separation, please. And thank you, Holy Spirit. Mm, a king of cups. Separation from a king of cups. Mm. Someone who could claim they are what they could claim they lonely. Yeah. They could see. I'm saying they received good news. They received news about your abundance. Like they can see, yeah, that you've been working on yourself, you changing yourself, you putting in the work. Thank you. Yeah. It's funny how the tower is falling right up under palm tree. <clears throat> Look, you separated from this king of cups. You got good news after you separated from this king of cups. Somebody had decided they want they want to work on a marriage with you. And they're gonna help you be more stable. And that's gonna cause talents for other people. Ooh, la, ooh. Song. This emperor is falling right up under lightning. This not a source is falling keys upon the rain. I'm telling you, they thought one night staying crying, dealing with the cars they dealt. Now they in heartbreak. Because now they got to deal with what they've been dealt. Okay? And they got to deal with what they dealt out to others. Okay? Manifested this snake. Ooh! Thank you, Spirit. Clear five feathers. Speak to me, speak to me. You know, my, my mouth hurt, my voice, you know, it ain't as strong as it used to be. But we gonna get it out now. I'm telling you, somebody thought that they was the man just because this emperor out here don't mean he an emperor. Because he provides support to, a, to the girl with a snake. I'm telling you. What is this that the flipped off in reverse? Queen of Cup. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. It's evident that this we got we got depression, emotional, moody. They could be fighting a lot. Like they're blocked. They have, like, they're going in the wrong direction together because they're not meant to be together. It's not working out, okay? Mm. Oh, yeah. It's going to be a big change. It's going to be a big change. The tower is coming. London Bridge is falling down, falling down, falling down. London Bridge is falling down, my fair lady. Ooh, wee. Give me some of these out of pentacles. What's being blocked? What's being blocked with this chariot in, in reverse, queen of cups in reverse? This is, oh, wee. He thought when he got with this, uh, Mm, damn. It's like the they 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 are stuck. They stagnant, stalemate. Stuck. 
Someone needs to make a choice to go in another direction. One of them. Thank you. Yeah. Cause it's been a, it's a lot of illusions. It's a lot of illusions that somebody is uh, very delusional about the relationship they're in. I don't know if they think it can work. They think that something can change. If it hasn't got better yet, it's not going to get better. Someone could be a Capricorn, a Scorpio, Gemini, Cancer. Uh, uh, heavy on the Cancer. Clear for this Emperor, this lightning. Oh, somebody think. Somebody think that where they went, they thought that they made the right choice. They felt like, oh, it was they made they made the right choice. They thought that was gonna be a power couple. They thought that that was a twin flame. Somebody actually thought that. This girl with the snake, this queen of cups in reverse. Cause that's what it is. They thought that she, you know she was a better choice. I wonder why. Why did this this uh king of cups energy think this queen of cups was a better choice? Clear for our king of spirit, if you don't mind. Why did he think she was a better choice? It could have been because of her career, the job she has. Somebody could be a Gemini. Yeah, they felt like they had a better future with her instead of you. Like, they would get closer to success. If that was with her, if they got into this divine union, which ain't divine, it ain't divine work for them. If they got into this union with her, thank you. Yo, but that shit coming to the end. And now they could be watching you. They could be stalking you with this world to the page of the swords. They could be watching you on social media. Cause they, they I don't think they stalking you at home. Clarify, are they stalking you? Cause your energy ain't even I here. That's how detached you are from this. You're not even out here. If if he's not watching you on social media, she's watching you on social media. She, he, he watching you on social media. She, what? it don't matter. Take it how it resonates. Y'all know? Because this could be a man with a man. Somebody watching somebody. Somebody talking about somebody, fighting about somebody. Got somebody in their mouth, on their mind. In their friend group, in their social circle. Something of that nature. Oh, are they watching the divine feminine or divine masculine on social media? No, but they know that they can't come back in your energy. With this ten of swords and seven of wands, they know they can't come back. They know that you mean what you say, you say, and you say what you mean. Yes, like you did all the investigating that you need to do to where you know, like you done all the thinking. You ask God, you ask for spiritual guidance to where you know 
you excite? Should you deal with this person? The answer is no. No, you, 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 you know, you intuitively know, you've been told, you've been warned, I'm here, you've been warned, now take heed to your warning, if God has warned you and showed you that this person is no good, they are just an in and out energy, they do not mean love towards you, okay, you know, they just in and out, they just look good, okay, they don't mean you no good. They're not going to help you or provide for you, uplift you, do anything of that nature. They're expecting you to do that for them, okay? They're expecting you to do that for them. They don't want to do that for you. They are unable. They are incapable of doing that for you. So don't think that they are because they're not, okay? Thank you. That's right. See things from a whole different perspective because they're not... Trust is being tested. Don't trust this person, okay? They know they're suffering. What is this? Yeah, they want a, they th they want a new beginning. What's this? All these cards. Yeah, because they know that... Yeah, they want a new beginning. They thinking of how they can come in and try to talk you into a new beginning, but it's not going to work. You know you've left because you know they're, they just, they lie. They're malicious. They don't care about you. They'll do anything to win. They'll do anything to keep you around. They'll tell any kind of lie to keep you around. Even though they see you in going in another direction that's better off for you, okay? And that's the truth. And that is the truth. They know they know that you're finna be happy and they're gonna try to do anything to stop it. Don't let this person stop you from receiving your happiness. Don't let this person come back and try to woo you. Yeah, don't let this person come back and try to woo you. Like they changed or something. They might try to come back and tell you what didn't happen or no don't feel sorry for this person none of it okay keep moving forward anything else they see you with this ace of wands ace of wands right above the empress they see you like they need to see things from their perspective they need to you know change their mindset because this is done this is a wrap any final messages come back in and woo you however it goes however it resonates for you however well watching this video don't let this person come back in and woo you and you you finna get married you finna be happy i'm telling you because they just being manipulative they think they're smarter than you yeah you might want to plan an exit because they planning to come towards you Anything else? They want to come towards you, though. Yeah, they plan, they plan, they think they can stop you. They have a plan to stop you. Don't let this person stop you, though.
They're gonna try to come over the store, but they've already been. They can you gonna humiliate them. Don't let this person come in and ruin what you are building. Okay, be mindful. Okay. Don't let the past come in. That's why it's the past. You're supposed to learn something from those people. Let their ass go. Let their ass go, okay? You got a, you got a real ex. I'm telling you, ever since you separated, things have been going up. Keep going up. Don't turn around. It's like if you turn around and look back, you're going to turn soft. Don't turn around and look back, okay? Keep moving forward. But... I'm going to leave it right there. I hope this helps. I hope it resonates. But always remember, use your own discernment. And always put God first in your life. And everything going to be all right. And I wish you all peace, love, and happiness. Till next time.